Biafra must come, whether they like it or not. Back at the take. <laughs> no, at the take, they wait till they write for your back. Nah? Oh, what to do our republic? Yes. Oh, represent the whole world republic. We are in freedom. No more sabotage. No more babasi. We are in freedom. What to do our need freedom? We are brand new freedom. No more Nigeria. We need freedom. What I want to say is, um, this is a special, um, special message to the British government and the British people. I want to let them to understand that uh, Biafra, apart from Biafra being a nation, Biafra is a religion. And being a religion, it is people believe and people wear of light. So British government should allow us to exercise our belief, our religion. Just like any other nation or any other group exercising their belief and religion. If they fail to do so, they are going to find it difficult. Therefore, it's a religion. That's why after more than 53 years, since the uh, civil war, Biafra is still in existence in the heart of millions and millions of people. Biafra 1967-1970 
is 100 times more than what it is now. More than six, more than six million Biafrans slaughtered in the altar of one Nigeria. Biafra is still existing. We are no longer the part that passed of the contraction. Let me end the contraction now. Go. Yes. Without freedom. Bring down the car now. 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 We are asking for sensation. It's our human rights. No, you're not killing anybody.